So whatever projects you work with, they show up over here in the recent section right here. So that is one place where you can find the projects that you've worked with in CapCut and also in your workplace. So over here, I have my QTube workplace and here you can see the projects right here. And you can see that these projects are untitled now. So they uh, do have contents, but they are untitled. Uh, that is because I haven't named them. If I were to go around over here and then click right here, then what happens is that it opens up um, this particular uh, page, as you can see with my video clip. And over here on the top, it says Untitled Project. So what I can simply do is I can go around and click and rename this to, let's say, for example, TTT Project right here, just like this. And then what happens is that the file will be renamed. Now, if I were to go back to home page right here, just like this, so let's just click on uh, that, you can see the Tutu project right here. If you were to click on the three dot button, then you can see that you can go around and rename the project from here as well. So I'm just going to go around and say second project right here, just like this, and type in OK. So this is another way to go around and rename as well. What you can also do is delete out the projects. So for that, you can go around from home page or from TutuTube and access out your projects right here. And here you can see that there's the second project. And if I want to delete it, then I can click on the uh, three dot button right here and hit the delete button just like this. So it says all the collaborators will no longer be able to access the file. So if you have shared out this project with other people, then they will lose access as well. And that is why it is confirming whether you really want to delete it. So if you're, um, uh, if you're sure, you can go around and click on confirm. And what happens is that the file will be deleted right here. So it's deleted as you can see right here and it's gone for good. And that is how you can rename and delete projects inside of CapCut. So I hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.